the steps I took to obtain my internship at NASA was first I researched um, NASA Develop on the internet and read about it and determined if it was a good fit for me and the steps that I needed to apply. And then after I did that, I live near NASA back home in Virginia, so I decided to contact some people at home and talk to them more about the program and uh, see if there were any additional tips or pointers that I could get from them. And that was about it. Before obtaining my internship, I went to the Career Center to get help with my resume and I sat down with the Career Center advisor and uh, went over my resume and how to better construct my resume and get more organization and what points to keep on the resume to make it a really strong resume. And so from going to the Career Center, I think I uh, built the strength of my resume and really made it a powerful tool for getting my internship. Over the summer I worked on an internship at NASA Develop in Virginia and I worked with the Earth Science Division and so um, I worked on a project called Appalachian Trail Health and Air Quality. I worked with a team of about five other members and we used NASA Earth observations, the satellites, to get data and uh, we were specifically studying the ozone along the Appalachian Trail. A typical day in my internship looked like coming into work and using NASA Earth observations to abstract the data and then I used that data in ArcGIS in order to form maps of ozone along the Appalachian Trail for high ozone months from May to September. And so another part of my day was to, um, I would attend meetings with my project partners, with my team members, and with my science advisors in order to make sure that my project was on the right track. From my internship, there were three major takeaways. There was, I took away professionalism, networking opportunities, and just in general knowledge. So the first professionalism is that I was required to dress up every day for work and for presentations I had to wear a suit and I gained um, professionalism of how to interact with my team members and with science advisors. And then networking opportunities, I got to meet a lot of the people that worked at NASA headquarters in Washington, D.C., and I got to network with them at a poster session at the end of the internship where I presented my research. And then lastly, for the, from the internship, I gained a lot of knowledge about my project along the Appalachian Trail, the ozone. I gained a lot of knowledge about NASA and then also about earth science and remote sensing. The professionalism and networking opportunities that I gained for my internship at NASA will help me in my future career plans and as, as I apply for graduate school. Um, the internship will help build my resume and the networking opportunities will allow me to build contacts with professionals in an area that I'm interested in pursuing.